Monday morning, the calm after the storm on Friday night. The bleachers blown over, left crumpled on the field. The scoreboard, now just a pile of metal. Inside the school, the roof of the gym rocked so hard, debris fell on the court. This isn't good, but it could have been a whole lot worse. It is ra uh, rapidly rotating. It is now on the ground. So News Chopper 9 tracking the tornado in the air as Friday night football was just about to kick off at Cass Midway. Surveillance video from that night shows people rushing inside, referees and firefighters trying to get everyone to safety. People frantically running to shelter, some barely making it into the school with the tornado hit. The winds throwing around water tanks, pushing over trailers, debris filling the air. The winds we got were probably in the 85 to 95 mile per hour range. Luckily, nobody was hurt, but it could have been a different story if school officials didn't act quickly. You know, the bricks and mortar and bleachers and things like that, that can all get fixed, but, uh, you know, we just want the people to be safe. The aftermath left on the football field for now, but that soon will be picked up. The Vikings have another game to play on Friday. Matt Evans, KNBC 9 News.